Hello. Ah. Hello everyone, today we are trying to build VTOL aircraft, which is short for vertical takeoff and landing. Such aircraft are able to take off vertically or from a short runway, but able to fly in the sky at normal speeds, similar to that of an aircraft that needs a longer runway. Let's go ahead and get into the first aircraft of today's video. Okay, here we have our first VTOL aircraft. I titled it Osprey 1 because I tried to make it as close as I could to the real world Osprey, also known as the V-22. Um, not too confident in these uh, propellers, but let's give it a go. All right, on the runway, let's kind of rotate these forward a little bit. and lift off. Let's try that again. Okay, back out on the runway, and let's give it another go. Hmm. Maybe I should do this instead. So what I did, I changed out the blades. I didn't think those were gonna be too successful in the first place for quad engines, and then I also switched out the engines for more powerful like f-16 type engines let's see if this works Nope. Well, um, perhaps I should make a new aircraft that might be a little more successful. All right, here's our next aircraft. I called it the VTOL Jet. And it's kind of a kind of like the Harrier slash F-35 slash kind of kind of looks like a F-15 and a MiG as well. Uh, anyway, uh, let's see if it actually flies. All right, on runway, looking good so far. Let's get the VTOL engines. They actually work. Oh, oh, hey, look at that. They actually do. Uh, hello. Oh. Hello. Ah. <clears throat> Let me just do a, a little tweak before we try again. Okay, so I just moved them forward a little bit because the jet was kind of leaning downwards earlier. Uh, let's give it another go.
Uh, okay, that might have been put a little too far forward. Uh, why is it spinning like this? Right, well, this jet just doesn't want to cooperate, so let's move on to the next one. And here we have what I called the X-Jet, inspired by the jet the X-Men used, which itself was inspired by the SR-71 Blackbird. However, the one they used had these uh, VTOL engines and could hold a crew instead of just one or two people. So let's go see if our version of it can actually fly. All right, here we are on the launch pad. Let's see if it works. Uh, don't know why their engines cut out. Oh, I think I know why. It's the air intake. Alright, hopefully that did the trick. Let's give it another go. Oh, it sure looks like it. Yeah, baby! That's what I've been for! Look at that! I will say this is a little hard to control because the control surfaces are pointed perpendicular to the engines. Okay, let's switch it up a bit. Let's try and first see if it flies like a normal airplane. Sure, seems like it does. Let's see if it can do a barrel roll. Yes, very successful. Much good. Alright, let's try and turn this around now. Okay, let's give that another go, after it stops playing hopscotch.
let's try and bring it in for a landing. Alright, deployed parachutes because things like this don't really like to stop that much. Not too sure if these parachutes are really doing anything. Still moving quite fast, even with parachutes deployed. All right, let's try and engage our secondary engines. Very cool. Much cool. Oh, uh, no. Why are you doing this? No. No. Well, uh, I guess let's move on to our next aircraft. Well, looks like Logan Nature has done it again. Here's my latest aircraft. I called it Val, named after the Valkyrie from the Avatar movie, at, at least the first one. I don't think it showed up in the second one. I did my best to try and recreate it. I don't know if it'll fly correctly, but let's find out. All right. Whoa. Didn't know I could do this with the camera. All right. Here we have the shuttle in question. I don't like how wobbly it is, but let's try and turn these. All right. Let's try and take off. Take off now, aircraft. There we go. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, oh no. Fatality. Well, it looks like I need to make some adjustments. But I'll be right back. Okay, I gave the wings a bit of structural support and changed these engines for some more powerful ones. They don't seem more powerful, but they can probably hold a lot more weight. All right, let's try and take off. Hmm, not quite as much lift as I was hoping for. Let me try and switch out the engines one more time. All right. Last chance, shuttle. Alright, let's try and take off like this. Nope! Oh boy. Is it wobbling so much? What the heck? Well, unfortunately, that one did not work out. But feel free to enjoy these honorable mentions.
And with that, if you enjoyed the video, consider hitting the like button and sharing it with a friend. And if you want to see more from me, consider subscribing as well. Thank you everyone so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye everyone!